coming into the studio. Otto from Otto and George. Otto. What's up, Otto? Hi, everybody. Hi. How you doing there, Hi. Otto? Hi, Mr. Anthony. Hi. Doing good, yeah. Uh, how was your party? I heard it was good. Two yeah. squad cars, not too uh, bad. Not too bad, too. Nice, nice. A couple of... Uh, Girls taken out in the rolled up carpet. Really? Brought to the <laughs> landfill. Yeah. You know, oh, the cool. colonel gave one coke that was too pure. Yes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> no. I love Phil Seymour Hoffman. Is she all right? That they're fucking dragging her out with blood coming out of her nose. Oh, yeah. <laughs> they're just so little. The far, my favorite scene is a far head take when he pulls his cock out at the pool. When yeah. he's so formal, he goes, I heard you have an enormous cock. May I see it, please? May I see it? And then you just hear. You don't see it, but he's, he shoots his forehead back about eight inches. That's his only reaction. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I've never seen kinda... that. A uh, guy do that. Yeah, it's he lifts so his bra up. His yeah. forehead just kind of goes. Forehead tightens up. That's the entire reaction. <laughs> I've done that before in scenes. <laughs> it's yeah. brilliant. No, you haven't. Yeah, Chip. So I haven't seen. I always have like jokes, but then I'm not on the radio. You guys get to say it like the date and stuff happens. Yeah, but. it's kind of uh, handy. Yeah, and then I I'm here like six months later and six I six months for the joke. Pathetic dated weak jokes. <laughs> Schnook that I am. But I did want to uh, say uh, uh, congratulations to our troops. They finally killed Ben Vereen. That's all I had. Sorry. <laughs> and then George goes, No, it's Ben Laden. No, oh, yeah, him too. Sorry, <laughs> George. Boy, I'm not at the cellar. <laughs> That's uh, hilarious. Yeah. And you got the summer haircut, Otto, I see. Uh, yeah, I said, uh, I went to the barber. I said, give me the George Clooney look. So the guy shaved my fucking head. Oh, you didn't want go, this? George Clooney doesn't look like this. He said, well, he would if he came in here. <laughs> That's actually the Jim Norton. Yeah, you're doing it the Jim Norton. Yeah, yeah. Jim I Norton. Just, I got tired of my gray hair, and I'm not going to dye it. I was just talking to Jimmy about that. And, um, yeah, it's very comfortable. You know, I don't yeah. have to worry about it in the morning and shit. So and easy to wash. I've been making people laugh for 30 years, and fucking Chaz Bono is, like, just a superstar now. <laughs> just for <laughs> yeah. lobbing the tits off and spackling the cunt shot. <laughs> uh, she looks like a fucking John Candy with smaller tits. <laughs> <laughs> fucking Lee, she doesn't have cock breath anymore. <laughs> but, um... <laughs> doesn't she look like Chris Penn? She really oh, yeah, 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 exactly, yeah. yeah. After yeah. his death. I know. You Shit. take that tree away from my daddy. <laughs> you stop pointing that penis at my daddy. <laughs> yeah. Cher couldn't be reached for comment, but she was seen skiing towards a tree in Colorado. <laughs> uh, thank you, Mr. Will. You, you would think she would have had an open mind about this whole thing, but she kind of does she said, it. Oh, that's fucking tricky. Nah. She's warming up um, a little she bit. She said but... she misses hearing her daughter's voice, that it's now like, hello. <laughs> Wait, I'm sorry. I gotta turn she does have that, phone off that here. deep voice now. Oh. Oh, yeah. my God. What a Trish, wreck. Trish is always giving me shit because I complain when I get up to do this show. I go, man, I'm so tired. She goes, ah, stop it. Once a year, you got to get up. <laughs> like, I, like, she thinks I get a full night's sleep. She doesn't know that. And then the she's morning, calling I'm, you while you're on the air. I in do the it. morning, I'm standing over her bed holding a ball-peen hammer. <laughs> you know, thinking about that. Oz wasn't so bad. It'd be worth a little piece of quiet <laughs> here. <laughs> Split her fat head open while she's sleeping. <laughs> gives me shit because I want to sleep another half hour. Who does it? If it's any Cranky. consolation, every morning I yeah. get up and Are think you? that. It doesn't get I'm easy. I'm like, I don't want to get up. No. Do you I don't set your fucking... clock so you get to, like... Four alarms on my iPhone. But, I mean, do you give yourself that extra half hour? By setting it yeah, earlier. Yeah, I set it uh, way earlier, and then uh, it's four alarms that are set like maybe five to eight minutes <laughs> apart. Really? And uh, yeah, because I need that, like, I need to wake up in gradual segments. <laughs> you should have like the coming out of stasis. Stand next to your bed as much money as you've given them. You know, <laughs> yeah. Just have him stand there and nudge you. You can nudge on. me. It goes yeah. time. Excuse giving him enough cash. Anthony, right? Anthony, <laughs> yeah. wake up. Yeah, it's you need more of your money yeah, in the bank. Guy. You know what the horror is, though? Uh, Kenny calls me oh. every day promptly at uh, 4.50. He did? He calls me. Yeah. <laughs> and... Um, it's it, it's my iPhone, so I have a picture of Kenny. Oh, God. So my alarm goes off first. <laughs> One alarm goes off first. And then I grab my phone, and I shut the alarm off, and I hold the phone in my hand, 
as I'm nodding back off a little bit. Yeah. So then the second it vibrates before it rings, I hit the sound thing so it doesn't ring. Right. But I turn and I get a vision of Kenny's <laughs> big face. Oh, Kenny's the first face I see in the morning. Oh, that God. fucking Frankenstein is yeah. the first thing I have to look at. Why don't you change it to like a, uh, a playmate yeah, or something? Play, yeah, uh, exactly. Because then it would just be, be more disappointing going, hello. Yeah. <laughs> you see that fucking face. It's just like, uh, it, it wakes me up. It makes me think, ugh, okay. Uh, yeah. It's really, no more it's getting like asleep. It's like a nightmare. assembly outfit he's wearing today. <laughs> assembly. Yeah. So well equaffed and iron today. Yeah, but he picks the worst colors. <laughs> yeah. He's, uh, he wears suits, okay, but yeah. he picks the worst color he suit. Does. That's the picture I have yeah, of Kenny when he calls. Oh, yeah. no, look at that. His, <laughs> that his, his, his angelfish that's, profile. Is that fucking horrendous? Yeah. Yeah. Angelfish. Yeah. Who came up with the angelfish? Jay Moore. It's the best line of the century. Jay. Jay Kenny looks like an angelfish. That is brilliant. <laughs> Angel. <Yeah. laughs> Fuck him uh. up. Fight him. <laughs> oh, hi, Roland. Oh, hey, Roland. Hey, Roland. Oh, thank you. Oh, what's going on there, Roland? Thank what's you, what's my going pedal. Going down there, Let's see right? what good. fucking Things albino pubic hairs you're having for lunch <laughs> today. No, hey, what, uh, I hear there's a, a premiere uh, going on wow. today or a screening. It's adorable. What, what's, it, what's it for? X-Men. For X-Men, right, right. That's what I heard. No, I can't go. I got shit to do. I just heard about it. Hmm. You weren't you know. invited by Roland, you mean? No, I wasn't. I had to hear about it because I never go to him. I sent to everybody. Did you? Oh, yeah. <laughs> How was the uh, Malcolm McDowell appearance? I, I didn't get it. It was really. I was just trying to get on rolling about it. Yeah. It's okay. Uh, was it great? Did, Malcolm was to, great. Yeah. Was it like yeah. meeting a beetle? It was like. Yeah, it, it, it actually was. It was very. And he was really cool and shit. Yeah. It wasn't an asshole. Did you bring up Clockwork Orange? We kept talking about, about it like crazy. Only yeah. if an old lucky man. Yeah, we didn't yeah. really bring up Clockwork. We didn't yeah. feel the need to. Yeah, really? it was. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> he must be a little tired of that being the only movie that people. Cause he's been I love Clockwork. Not, maybe movies. not as much as you guys, but yeah. I, I only saw the movie for the first time recently. Really? You know, you know it's what? The, the last couple of years, I fucking it's love so, it. It's yeah, I don't really. You know what the film. fucked yes. up thing is? Yeah. So think visually. about forty. Year, that's a forty-year-old movie. Yeah. Right. Think about walking in somewhere and having to talk about something you did forty years ago. Yeah. And be like passionate about it and shit. Yeah. Mm -hmm. God. You I know, mean, obviously, I know we we're all. All a little younger than Malcolm McDowell, yeah. But uh, picture that much time and, and like, what did you do? I, is that all right? I, yeah, I rode my bike to the store. Yeah. He, hold on, he's different That's than other fun. guys though because he's really still into it. Yeah. I don't think he was faking it. I think he really still has the passion for that movie. No, he's very proud of it. Yeah. Well, we've had guys come in and like, yes, that was thirty years ago. All right, enough. Yeah. It made him but, a legend. Though. Yeah, but not yeah, Malcolm. Malcolm's yeah. like the great. The Otto, he was doing movie. he was doing lines for the movie. He, he was. He didn't have to really? do that. Yeah. yeah, yeah, and he signs autographs like Vidi Well. Yeah, oh, Vidi Well. Vidi well. What did he? Uh, what cool. lines did he say from the movie? Like we uh, had him do a couple for <laughs> Eric, our producers, one of our producers. Oh, we had him goof on E Rock a little bit. Yeah, but we just during guys, the interview, he was throwing out. Oh yeah, lines. he did. Uh, so he imitated Dim too. Oh but yeah, we did? we we did a little sing in the rain, just talking through it. No, we didn't. Man, I wanted to sing it with him, but I never hard to ask. That was good. So great. Yeah, I would love to have just sang that while he kicked me. I got to see that in a movie theater in a re-release. They used to have these theaters in New York that played old movies. Yeah, so you could see them on yeah, the big, big screen, screen again. Much better. I yeah. did see it once, too, on the same thing like that. It was yeah. like a, late, a release like in the late 90s or whatever they did it. Same thing with 2001. There was, there's nothing like seeing that on a big screen. It's very yeah. boring on the television. It's a, yeah, you it's need really that dreadfully big boring. spectacle. Yeah. Fucking really do. It, yeah. Bond movies, too, or you have to see on a big yep. screen. A lot of movies you could see at home, you know. I think it's uh, especially before they came out with widescreen. Yeah. Like, what an insult to a director uh, to not like letterbox it at least or, yeah. or something like when they show it in fucking it looks too that cramped. three. T oh, the, what it's they call just it pan and scan. Yeah, yeah. they use either pan and scan or they just cut the edges off. Yeah. I remember as a kid watching it'll just like be like a, a candle in a in a restaurant scene and two noses. <laughs> Yeah. Yes. That's what the director was going for. Yeah, that was the look he was going about for. Blue you know what? Candles, you might as well change yeah. the fucking dialogue. Yeah. Like, not only the curses, which are an abomination also, but, like, you might as well just change the dialogue and the fucking lighting. Yeah. You're changing the way the director saw this fucking movie yeah. to fit it into your dumb, dated, you, you should get a new TV TV. The directors exactly. are the assholes. Yep. Exactly. They know that the movies, the movies would have lived on TV, so they should have fucking filmed them differently. Fuck the directors. Oh. What? <laughs> well, yes. That's crazy. They knew it was going to go on to TV. Well, the TV people should have fucking done it. They couldn't figure that the out. Right way. 
like a movie like um, Lawrence of Arabia was shot in that seventy millimeter, mm. like like three cinema scope, yeah, <laughs> three projectors to get the image on the oh, screen. Wow. Oh, really? So, wow. Yeah, it was such the the such the Ben Hur, you know. Yeah, Ben Hur. Get people to stop watching TV and come to the movies. They got they had to. Wasn't it those the game. Uh, curved screen kind of yeah, yeah, cinema? Was it cinema scope or yeah, seventy millimeter? The fucking film was like this wide. Yeah, the strip of film was like this wide. Jesus Thirty five millimeters like that. Yeah, or something like that. Oh. amazing. That's crazy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't that a mistake? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, well, I just. Fucking, uh, the edited for television. Sorry version. about the, the. I was supposed to. I called Jimmy to come to the cellar, and I and Trish was just like, "You don't network enough. You should be there all the time. You don't kiss ass. That's why, you, you know, because I've had. There's been like a little drought in the stand up for me anyway lately. But um, she just kept breaking my balls, and I just I said, "All right, now no, I'm not going." I was like, "Forget the whole." Thing. Aha! Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we had a good time, but the city sucks, man. Fucking twenty seven bucks for two beers. I go, did I break something? I'm just That's fucking walking ridiculous. in this bar. It's twenty seven bucks. <laughs> yeah. Fucking mother. Yeah. Ridiculous. Find a lump. Mother, catch cancer. Mother. That's yeah. right, man. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, Danny's got this uh, cinema scope. This thing up where he's they're showing what. What a movie looks oh. like in regular television, yeah. and then what it's supposed to look like. Can I go back scan. To that first uh, example when they, was really funny. Yeah, this is hilarious. What is that for Seven oh, Brides okay. for Seven Brothers or something? And yeah. then look at all that's oh my missing. God, yeah. You're missing all that. Like the director and the yeah. fucking uh, uh, director flop, of photography flop and just brides and a hoof. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's supposed to be. Yeah. It's like you're missing so fucking yeah. much. I can't oh, yeah. stand any movie that is still formatted. Yeah. For a, a regular shit little television set, wow. yeah. it's like I don't get. Well, they're so cheap yeah. right now. Yeah, if some fucking asshole can't afford it, they deserve to die. Well, aren't they shaping TV sets in the in the form of? Yeah. Like, now they're getting uh, even bigger. Uh, yeah, 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 mm -hmm. yeah. Which is uh, amazing. Yeah, Ben Hur is one of those movies where if you're not watching that widescreen, yeah, you're an idiot. Oh really? Yeah. Well, it's an amazing fucking movie. Oh, God, look, at that. look at what you're yeah. missing. The pan and scan. <laughs> Pan and scan so really my dick. That. Yeah, I know. It's really oh, good. A yeah. horse's face. Look. Yeah. It's <laughs> very tight shot of it's the Sarah horse. Sarah Jessica Parker starring <laughs> in Ben Hur. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> it is a crime. I, I, just, I, I think it takes so much away from fucking shit. Yeah. That's why it is cool to go when they show him back in the movie theater again. Because we saw something recently. It was just it, not even. Uh, it was Back to the Future. Yeah, go see Back to the Future in the movie screen. theater. That'd, it was kind of cool. cool. And I've seen it like a thousand times on yeah. television, and even in a widescreen yeah. uh, a television. But then when you just see that shit in the theater, yeah. it kind of brings you right back, you know? For the, the Ziegfeld, you, for a while, was doing that. They, they like, you go see Apocalypse Now, mm. uh, re-released. Fucking great. It's so different. Yeah, yeah. It is, it, you, you don't realize what you're missing. Remember years ago, too, when you saw a movie in a movie theater? That was it. Yeah, it was you. You never were going to see it like that again. Yeah, it was just mm -hmm. you'd see it maybe uh, like five years later right. on Channel Five, Creature yeah. Feature or something. It's just not amazing. We don't know how good we have it now. You can just own any yeah. movie you want. Pop well, you it just in. Just go to fucking Netflix and pop it on anytime yeah. you want. You know, you're not the slave. I remember looking through the TV guide. It's like, it's oh, true. I love that movie, and yeah. you'd have to. And if you weren't there when it was on, you yeah. fucking missed it. That's true. You had to be home when it you was had on. You had to see the Wizard of Oz. And it was like a year. Yeah, yeah. Every, oh, every year you had to wait for certain movies. You're yeah. right. How about uh, Star Wars? Okay, is that way you had to watch that How many years movie? did Star Wars take? I would From love to 77. know. From 77. Is there any way of finding that out? Yeah, you want to know when it aired on TV the first time? Yeah, because time? I remember when yeah. I was growing up, you, you would start counting down because then they finally would announce, okay, in the year, whatever. Oh. And you're like, oh my God, only a year to go and we get to see Star Dude, Wars again. That isn't even as bad. TV, right? Okay, I but remember like Star Wars is, ran forever. I saw theaters, so. Planet of the Apes when I was a kid, yeah. and uh, mm. and uh, <laughs> when, when I was done, I was thinking that like when we left the theater, all I'm thinking is I'm I'm never going to see that again. Yeah. Like, like made that. it way more right. important to go to the movies, right? Yeah, you paid close attention. Jimmy Different Norton. Experience now. This is yeah. the way we're going to do things from now on. I'm going to raise my Jimmy hand. Jimmy raised his hand, <laughs> and we called on him. But I was yeah. no, I was watching something recently, and they were interviewing Scorsese and Eastwood about uh, uh, restoring old movies. And I forget which one of them said it, but they said all movies, or it was a stat, all of all the movies made before 1950, yeah. half of them are lost forever. 
of all half the movies made before 1950, no one will ever see again. They're gone. Just gone like they just gone. decomposed. Yeah, they uh, probably I, sucked. They, I'm yeah. sure they weren't gems. Yeah, yeah. most of them. Point. They weren't all gems. Yeah. Ah, yeah. The stay second, tuned for the creature. Yeah. The Negro next door was probably lost because <laughs> it was about a black man that moved in and everything went well. And they're like, get rid of this propaganda. <laughs> <laughs> you know? Once you transfer a movie to DVD, whatever deterioration is is now frozen in that in that quality. But we they don't know how long. D DVDs last before they deteriorate. Now. Yeah, all film is de always deteriorating. The second the film is exposed, it's already beginning to you know to age and die. Yeah, and, you know. they got to be kept in in vaults like a yeah. hu humidify uh, the right humidity, yeah. temperature, light. Yeah, everything fucks it up. Yeah. Uh, beginning in September of 82, Star Wars was shown on pay-per-view subscription service. Five, wow. All uh, right, that's 82, 77. Six years, right? Five, yeah, that's, six years. That's not bad. That's, yeah. that's I mean, bad it's bad compared it's to today, bad. especially back then. It's, but, it, but back then, you dealt with that. Even you know? my giant has to be kept in an air conditioned vault. It's <laughs> fucking awful movie. That why? Was. Would, yeah, yeah. <laughs> why would they protect that one? I remember watching a lot of those, like one uh, TV guide for Newsday used to be funny as oh, fuck. Like yeah. they used to put really funny uh, shit in there uh, when they when they talked about the movie, gave a synopsis. And some of those one star horror movies were great growing up. Oh yeah, Channel Five and Channel Eleven would play the worst oh, fucking ratings. Yeah. Yeah. From, from the Black Lagoon ripoffs. Yeah. Wasn't horror even films the real aren't one. supposed to be a patch of blue. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you got to read the rest of this, Ann, because. It's it's way different. It was way different back then. Oh, beginning in September '82, uh, Star Wars was shown on pay-per-view subscription service uh, scattered throughout the country. Despite the fact that only half a million households were wired for pay-per-view, HBO showed the film during the winter of '83 and was disappointed at the lack of interest due to their earlier pay-per-view showings and the film's release on video cassette. Star Wars failed to rank amongst HBO's top ten popular films. CBS aired it on regular TV only after this. So, so right, figure so, yeah, oh, so about 1984. Yeah, so yeah, the made winter it to of regular, TV. On, on cable, so it's probably early 84. Right. Yeah, yeah, that's over. like Bill Gates complaining he didn't win a $2 scratch off ticket. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck it. What am I yeah. supposed to feel bad? Shut yeah. up. <laughs> It just fucking... it just shows where we were because now a movie's in the theaters. When is Hangover 2 going to be available on DVD? In three months. Yeah. yeah. Tops, yeah. right? Now Pops. as they shoot the goddamn yeah. thing, it's on TV. <laughs> <laughs> hey, uh, Otto, you like uh, newer movies? I know you like talking about the classics. The last, and, uh, and movie that impressed me, um, I don't know. I mean, um, uh, I guess the remake of True Grit was pretty good. I yeah, like that. I, I like that. I like that was Jeff, okay. Jeff Bridges is, is in a good pe period now. He's he playing, plays a good weirdo, right? Yeah, he's playing good weathered characters now. That court um, scene in there was great when he's yeah. just sitting there testifying. Yeah. yeah. I, I still think the John Wayne movie was better, even though John Wayne was a, was wasn't really a great actor. He just his no. presence. Amazing presence. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. What and about, then you had Robert Duvall. You just had a better cast than that, you know? What about uh, um, the last good comedy? We always ask you guys that. I don't know. I mean, it's, and you're probably going to go way back to I don't to know. Like, fucking The Hangover, I guess, was all right. I don't know. I don't fall down laugh at it. Mm -hmm. I don't know. That fucking uh, Kingpin, I'll watch every time oh, it's yeah. on TV. Of course. That's, that's oh, yeah. great. Bill, Bill Murray still does great shit. I don't he, know. But he, then, then he does artsy shit. Yeah, he loses a lot of people. I like super yeah. bad. I don't love Bill Murray at all. I'm not, not a fan. Really? Not a fan. No. I think he's the, I think he's the, the the hippest guy ever from Saturday Night Live. Yeah, his his movies are still like good. He's still like doing good shit. Mm. Eddie Murphy's lost his joy completely. Oh, yeah. He has no <laughs> joy for what he does anymore. No, you he's can just tell. banking the money. He doesn't give a fuck. You yeah, know? not doing Dan Aykroyd. Doctor Doolittle. A Aykroyd just, Aykroyd's doing well. <laughs> well, <laughs> well, 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 sells tequila, right? I now think something. So, yeah. yeah. What the fuck he's doing? <laughs> He had a little drop off. Yeah. Well, yeah. He fucking. It's all been downhill since Dr. Detroit. Yeah, Dr. Detroit. Oh, God. <laughs> 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 it's awful. I've seen better film on teeth. <laughs> that fucking, uh, yeah. <laughs> Remember the song for it? Doctor <clears throat> ooh, ooh, Detroit. Yeah. Oh, no. Danny, that, for the good. 80s, that was a decent Doctor ooh, yeah. ooh, Detroit. <laughs> I don't remember, but I remember that Yikes. part of it. You know? Oh, that will stay in your fucking head. Uh, yeah. Am I remembering it wrong? That fat lady who was the gangster in that with the giant tits who was pretty scary. <laughs> Forget her name. Iraka? <laughs> yeah. Something like that. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Hey, this guy's got a great observation about Ghostbusters. That Steve in Nashville. Good. Steve. Oh. Yes. Yeah, get the uh, the old VHS copy of Ghostbusters, and when they uh, when they did it, pan and scan, um, 
er, Ernie Hudson was literally cut out. He was always the fourth character. <laughs> oh, so they just showed the three guys. <laughs> wow. Yeah, yeah, because he always walked on the end. And every, every shot, you know, he was always on the end. And so in the uh, pan and scan version, you only saw him like maybe twice. Yeah, you never wanted to be on the end when they were filming back then. <laughs> no. You just know, ah, oh, fuck! I'm the one going to be cut, cut out for TV. Yeah. Oh, what is, is that? This, something? Yeah, Dan this Acker, looks that's so it. bad. <laughs> that was his attempt at a nutty professor. <laughs> He's doing a funny dance in the big group. <laughs> oh, oh wow! Is it what happened to him? The big dance number. Yeah. Why it was a staple of the '80s, really. Oh. Oh. oh my yeah. god, it's just horrible. White people should never dance unless it's at the end of a rope in a Clint Eastwood movie. <laughs> Stop that shit. Where's the song, though? There's a song. That was oh. with James Brown, by the way. You want to hear the theme? Doctor, the theme for yeah. Dr. Detroit? Yes. Uh, uh, uh. Thank you. Like no. no. Can you get the uh, opening credits? Uh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> The opening credits to Dr. Detroit. Detroit. Yeah. Why did I bring the show to a new one? No, no, fucking 80s movies had these weird... Oh yeah, these weird like things in them. That, that like the big dance number. Yeah. It was it was never funny. No. Nobody, no. Oh, excuse me, ever <laughs> laughed at a big dance number. No one laughed you at did that. When you belched. I got to make you it hot. That? <laughs> yes, of oh. course. That That's gives it the reverberation very sound. Weird. So it's like oh, 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 the yeah, yeah. Odd <laughs> yeah. yeah, every pussy out there just got wet thanks to me. <laughs> You're welcome. Every pussy just snotted. Oh, God. <laughs> was that Devo that did it? Really? Yeah. Hang on. The Doctor Detroit. The, wow. They got Devo, huh? Ooh, Damn. Fucking shit. All right. That's, uh, that is something. Yeah. Uh, that made the great outdoors look like Masterpiece Theater. <laughs> <laughs> I don't Terrible. think I've ever seen a movie, it. to tell you the truth. No. That's it. I don't see that. Wait. That's, that's, that's it. Devo. That's Dr. Devo. Love the love. Enough with the synthesizers. Yeah. Like that movie DC Cab. Probably the exact oh, same song. Oh, DC Cab. Same, yeah. Yeah. Wow. same shit, right? I don't remember if it's yeah. that. Irene Cara. Yeah. This is horrible. Yeah, yeah my wow, buddy Charlie bad. Barnett. Dr. You know the story about Charlie Schwartz. Barnett? No. Black guy from DC Cab. He was... He he lost Saturday Night Live because he couldn't fucking read, and that's how Eddie Murphy got cast. Oh shit! Yeah, and uh, he was um, he was a street performer. He used to make a fortune down in Washington Square Park, and uh, he was always high when I saw him. And then he goes, uh, he goes, I just read for this uh, movie about a black guy that crashes a a spaceship and shit. I go, all right, he's high, and then. That movie, uh, Brother from Another Planet, came out. <laughs> he was actually talking about that. He read for that. Brother from Another yeah. Planet. Yeah. Do you never saw that movie? No. Was Jim Jarmusch. I heard about it. I think but Jim Jarmusch or somebody. Yeah. There are certain movies that I know I'll just never see. Yeah. Really? And I think that's one of them. You don't want to waste two hours. No. That. Soul Plane. I know I'll just never watch oh, that. Oh, what about Snakes on a Plane? Same. I've seen that. You, it was yeah. horrible. I knew yeah. it was going to be horrible going yeah, into it. You don't it, have though. two hours to give to that. I just. Uh, nah, no. Nah. There are some movies. Bad Lieutenant again right yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I know what you mean yeah there's certain movies and I, I see like the trailer for it and you're yeah. just like I'll never fucking see that yeah Could give a shit yeah I'm with uh, you the other day I woke up and uh, fucking uh, turn on the TV and Lifetime is <laughs> on and Jay Moore is in Picture Perfect uh huh and, and it's just like watching Jay try to be this this romantic guy with, just with say trying to be a human wealth. being <laughs> trying to be a human being uh, <laughs> it ruin it for you it was just like like uh, believe me uh, I, I like i like jay but watching him in that character is just like he should have won an Academy Award. <laughs> oh. He's with so fucking, not him. Yeah. Oh, He's with okay. old stank pussy fucking right. Jennifer Aniston. <laughs> Jennifer Aniston. <laughs> and uh, yeah, you see uh I never realized Casey Anthony Casey, has such fucking big juicy Casey tits. Anthony's got to, I was just the last commercial. I was just looking at Casey Anthony pictures. I love that murderer. Her fucking she was wearing this shirt yesterday with the, and her tits were showing on the on the case uh, on the, on the, in the courtroom. She got some ample fucking tits. Are they Who's heaving? That? Yeah, they're like, they're like heaving. They think she's on trial for killing her daughter. Killed her daughter. Oh, another one. And, of those? Um, yes. Yeah, yeah. Uh, two but year she's, old kid. You know, 
Really? She's yeah. white trash. She is looks that the one that drove nice. a car in the water? Or? No, no, that's Susan no. Smith. This oh, one, no, just, there was, there was one a new one. Drove a car in the oh, water. that's right. There was Andrea <laughs> Yates who drowned him. There was yeah. Susan Smith who drowned him. Yeah. And there was the new lady. The new lady was. Uh, <laughs> well, you need uh, to get a bigger tub. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah the new lady had one. Uh, <laughs> one got out though. Yeah. One of the, I guess, a ten-year-old or something. Yeah, got out. escaped. Yeah. He, How about he, the yeah. Long Island rapist? They go and they, they go into that Rifkin guy for advice. Now. Serial killer. Right? Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. And the, the news guys are like, well, uh, Joel Rifkin said, look for a guy who will go unnoticed carrying a large burlap bag like a landscape or something. And then they go. How about that Joel Rifkin, a good American, the go-to guy? It's like, he did the same fucking thing. Yeah. You know, they're treating him like he's like the nostalgic, like, sweetheart. He's yeah. another guy who strangled fucking 19 women for no reason. <laughs> what a great fuck, guy I mean, helping us solve this crime. That's nice. Blowing him kisses from the studio. You know, he didn't have to do this. <laughs> that, that yeah, is he is didn't a, have to no. kill all those women either. Yeah. That's a great fucking point, though. You get someone who, who would have a bag they could carry f legit, like yeah. a painter or Oh really? right, yeah. somebody that would would actually not be noticed. So if they got pulled. Like if you, if, so if you just happen uh, to look upon them and, and they had a fucking a big burlap thing. Yeah, yeah. Are you trying crazy? to solve the crime, or is this I am. your vicious nocturnal activities? No, I think <laughs> it was <laughs> like Voss. You're yeah. trying to solve this one. Yeah. <laughs> well, Voss oh, yeah. said when he's on the road, he's an FBI profiler. Yeah. Oh yeah. Voss yeah. plays golf. Filing. No, no. Yeah. He tells people when they say, "What do you do for a living?" Because yeah. of course, the, why would they know he's a comedian yeah. after 30 years? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they say to him, "What do you do for a living?" And this fucking daydreaming zilch says, "I'm an FBI profiler." Really. So we called like, them on oh, it. Oh, that's, <laughs> that's interesting. He yeah. couldn't be a stupid. They're probably like, no wonder everybody's being murdered. <laughs> yeah. 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 What a dope he is. And then we try to play act with the guy. Like, yeah. okay, let's see how this goes. And he just had nothing. Yeah, yeah. give us yeah. a profile. Let's yeah. say uh, you found a, a dead uh, hooker. First you um, dust for DNA. Yeah, 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 exactly. <laughs> Dumb stuff like that. Uh, well, first of all, uh, <laughs> Do we have that first of all, there's never going to be a second of all. I like uh, to find a motive first. <laughs> uh, Do we have that production piece so Otto can see it? He yeah. thought the, Atl it? the Atlanta just... child killer was a description of whoever was killing people in Atlanta. <laughs> <laughs> he was very young. <laughs> no stupid face. You're wrong again. Can I bring Bonnie with me? <laughs> be because well, Otto's here, I think we're going to play real fast. It's quick. This is uh, yeah. Voss. Okay. We found another body. This is the third one this week. <laughs> I think it's about time we call in the FBI. Somewhere out there, a killer is on the loose. Why, yes, Sheriff. I have been following that story in the papers. It used to be such a peaceful little town. And there's only one man who can catch him. Now, don't you worry. I'm going to send my best man down there to help you in your investigation. <laughs> but he was busy. Here comes fucking ferret face. Whatever. <laughs> All right, Agent Voss. Someone's out there murdering innocent women. I want you to go down there and assist the local sheriff. You're one of the... You're one of the bad... You're... Get down there and help the sheriff. <laughs> How could he be a profiler? His vocabulary is so bad. Yeah, but no one listens. This summer, the Opie and Anthony Show presents a comedy about an idiotic comedian pretending to be an FBI agent. So you uh, you worked a lot of murders before? Now we're doing mainly a lot on uh, terrorists and terrorist type threats and stuff like that. But, you know, back back in the day, it was more murders. What are some of the cases you worked on? Uh, just you know, Seattle, the, the Green River. What do you call? I can talk a lot about it. I don't get this much in detail. Starring Jim Norton. He just keeps saying profile, profiler, other profilers, profile. And Rich Voss. Great minds think a lot. I like Oh my oh, God. The profiler. Coming to a theater nowhere near you or anyone else. Thank baby Jesus. <laughs> yeah, great yeah. minds think whatever. a lot. Whatever. Uh, great yeah, river, yeah, whatever. Uh, <laughs> just, uh, uh, sounds like he loves his work. That's great. He, he he literally couldn't be a stupider man. <laughs> oh, man. Don't. Uh, not precious on the Twitter. This is a great story. Just came in from South Carolina. Oh. After a two-day search, they found an 87-year-old woman who went missing Friday. Mm -hmm. They found her face down 
in a pile of fire ants. <laughs> oh! oh! Oh my God! Well, that's gotta stink. Was that fucking Aardvark, Betty? <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, Aardvark, Betty! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Aardvark, Betty is missing. Nobody Fate. knew where she was. <laughs> <laughs> she would always fucking snort up local ants because that's what Aardvarks do, not improver. <laughs> <laughs> Face down in a fire ant pile. They got her. Try to brush off ants best they could. Oh, she fell face first in a fire, and they oh. couldn't even get all the ants off. Of all the unlucky places to fall, bear trap one, fire ants <laughs> fire two. Fire ants. <laughs> yeah. The dummy. Oh. Yeah. They got her into an ambulance. Then I think the decision was made to get her over to the hospital. <laughs> That's right. Fire ants. Yes. Uh, did they ravage her? Yes. Uh, was there an African American attempting to remove the ants with a shoe heel or a hammer? <laughs> <laughs> oh, she has epilepsy to begin with. Oh, so. oh boy. Oh, yeah. Great, she was, the ants all thought she wanted to dance. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's our dark Betty. Yo, what's up, bitch? <laughs> saved her, then she shook him off of her. <laughs> she was walking down the road. <laughs> <laughs> the ants kept falling off her old nose and lips. They just kept trying to bite her, and she would shake around, bite her own dumb tongue off. <laughs> she she had to put her own vulva into her mouth to keep from choking on her tongue. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking dopey old bag. Stay home. <laughs> just stop wandering everywhere. Where's it? Where's our uh, Betty? She's just wandering again. <laughs> <laughs> she used to wander to pick up aluminum cans. Oh, oh great. Spies, Betty. <laughs> you don't like her, huh? What's her real name? <laughs> uh, something. Mary Clark. <laughs> wow. Uh, How good plain. Fire Is that Mary Clark? <laughs> good oh, news. They Jesus. found her bad news. She was severely dehydrated. And by one account, she suffered from thousands of fire ant bites. Oh, mm. fire ants. That's one true. of those will fucking. Any audio of her? You're fired. <laughs> <laughs> to the ants. <laughs> she sounds like. Oh, That's your Charlotte area. Uh, of course they are. Uh, God. I, I, I wish this was a fucking an ad for tire irons and one just flew into this woman's head. <laughs> yeah. Oh, it's a short one, I think. Speed Earl. I hate you. At speedy. commercials. At Speedy. Okay, oh, well, we start off with a story that just might give you the chills. Yeah, an 87 year old woman is missing, oh. was missing for days, and then yesterday she was casters. found alive, face down in a fire ant bed. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, sorry, can you go back to left? <laughs> you know, it really might, Dondi and Judy. This this really strikes okay. a chord with some of you. Maybe you have elderly loved ones, or maybe you're even a caretaker. <laughs> well, today we know a little yes. bit maybe more you're about an what aunt happened in this Like old people's faces. <laughs> <laughs> Why can't they find the comedy in this? One of the <laughs> fights of her exactly. life. A That's the last photo of Brenda ever taken. <laughs> Clark went missing near the house at home on Friday. That pig Sunday, lady. <laughs> two firefighters, part of a team of searchers, found her. They just the happened to see her off to the side, laying face down, <laughs> uh, pretty much in a fire ant. A pile of a knockout. They cut her, they cut off the fire ants the best they could. They got her back to a, a waiting ambulance, and she was treated at the scene, and then I think the decision was made. Uh, to get her over to uh, Palmetto Rich Memorial Hospital. Oh, really? She was labeled critical. Oh. Her daughter said she has <laughs> epilepsy, <laughs> but is on medication. <laughs> baby on. She's not You're surprised her mom took off down the street. <laughs> she is I'm surprised she didn't come <laughs> back. Her little ex on the edge of a straight razor. <laughs> Yeah, you might want to pass both kilos. ways to save time. The sheriff time. doesn't know how long Clark was walking what a and how burden. long she was She's on the ground. Exactly. He calls the search successful. Finding Clark is what they were after. Yeah. Just not Looking like for this. a fat lady with but ants on her face. Story, there she is. Found. There's only one of her. I'm not taking a picture without Michael face down in a pool of fire ants. Thousands of fire ants. And my father assured him that either his signature or the fire ants would be on the contract. Oh, <laughs> ah, shit. I could have been a contender <laughs> instead a of a fire ant, end. which is what I am. <laughs> hey, we're, we're all going to learn something here, though, because now yeah. they got to give you a little, little something. Oh, is that what this is? <laughs> yes. As, or you think they may wander off. We talked to some experts oh. in that area at USA. They say that it's a good idea to get a bracelet. To break their legs. Dig up spongy steaks in there, covered with feces. Or shatter their shins with a hammer. This way. We they have to stay seated. Hobble your elder legs. Hobble them. Or tie their shoelaces together. Hobbling. Next to a fire ant pile. Watch them eat ants. shit. That's what a fucking ant eating bitch. Dumb fire ants. Oh, they must have been all in her eyes and hair. Good. What a clod.
What happened? She probably saw the fire ants and just panicked. Or, or maybe she wanted to tackle them because she thought they were after the president. <laughs> <laughs> she didn't know any better. Yeah, she didn't know. She thought they were treats. <laughs> she was trying to... Yeah, she, she thought to be... She had probably had chocolate in her mouth. And she wanted to have some chocolate-covered ants. <laughs> she was stupid. <laughs> she thought they were Werther's Caramels. She was taking them to her grandson. <laughs> you uh, dummy. Shove your face in there. Oh, oh, there's hit me dumb like grandparents a... with their dumb ribbon candy. Oh, they really are. Oh, it they? hurts my tongue. <laughs> well, I think that worked. Thank you, Not Precious. I'm very funny. Yeah, look at that. Fire ants are nasty. They're Fire. fucking horrendous. Just the name. How, yeah. is, how is that newsworthy? Oh. She wasn't even killed or anything. Nah. She just oh, tripped. Oh, damn. Oh, what do you say? Those are the bites. That's what my cock looks like. Yeah. Oh, oh shit. Yeah. Might want to get that checked out. It's a lumpy <laughs> firearm. Fucking nah. fire ant. <laughs> do you ever see that thing with the natives in one of these tribes to become men? Where yes, they fucking put I, on the gloves made of... But yeah, they're not yeah. fire ants. They're worse than fire ants. Yeah. They make fire ants look like pussies. I think they did that on, uh, not Jackass, but the Wild Boys. Yeah, they... Steve-O. They put their arms in some shit. Yep. Let me yep. see, Danny. Oh, that maybe that's what I'm thinking of instead what is of the it, tribe. Spider? Is, uh, what, what is that? What is that? Fucking, it's a it, it's a fire ant nest oh, pile. Wow. Of them. They, yeah, they're just all. Say, I just got the heebie-jeebies uh, looking at that. Wait, that's not dirt. There's no, dirt in there I don't somewhere. Think no, so. well, I don't think so. That gives oh, me the heebie-jeebies. Oh, what look, color I'm, I'm of getting fire ants? Fire. They're like red. Oh man, it's got to be some. I want to see the 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 ones that the the. There's some nasty bugs out. In this man to become a man, what they do is they they capture these. I mean, these are fucking jungle ants. Yeah. They're like fucking small ponies, (laughs) and they fucking they drug them and they weave them into these gloves. They make these gloves. Yes. And uh, so they, when you put your hand in. This cluster of ants cannot escape, and all they do is bite you and inject you with venom, and you have to keep the gloves on your hand, <laughs> oh, why would and their arms that? are black when they pull them out. They're black from the venom. And this is just to become a man? It's a, it's That's a, how Lisa Lampanelli got in a friar's club. <laughs> 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 you die. What happened to just fucking abroad to become a man? Dude, yeah, they right. have to go through this uh, ritual 20 fuck? times. 20 times? They're very it's, bored over there. Yeah, What's this guy doing? If you, wow. Let me see. It says fun with fire he's, ants. Uh, he's killing fire ants wow. and, and <laughs> with different things. So he just opened up the fire ant hole. They all come pouring out, and he's putting hot, hot glue yeah, agitate from them. a hot glue gun. Oh, you ever yeah. see that show with thousands? Thousand ways to die on fucking oh, Spike yeah, Channel. Yeah. It's hysterical, right? <laughs> it really is funny. There's one grand lady that should have stayed home. <laughs> it's great. It's, it's cheap reenactments. <laughs> She's shooting a gun to visit her aunt. <laughs> yeah, it really is. The, they're cheap, horrible oh, reenactments. It's hysterical. Bullet ants? That's yes. coming in a lot. Can, can we see, is there any way to see we the... we got to uh, see bullet ants now. Do, the, those gloves made of ants? Yeah. Those are. I'd rather not have gloves. No, yeah. no. I don't want to put on the ants glove again. <laughs> yeah. They don't keep my hands toasty. I don't want to be a M80. man. <laughs> Guy's shoving an M80 in one of the ant holes. <laughs> Still better than Dr. Detroit. <laughs> Hell yeah. Deleted scenes. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Go you get him. Oh, why them. is he fucking with the ants? Oh, yeah. that's not nice. Why does he leave them oh, alone? Why do you do that? Hey, <laughs> 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 that caused some damage. Cheap, blowing cheap up. firework. That, that is was. a horrible M80. Yeah, where the fuck did he get that that's thing? Cheap dude. shit. This guy's, yeah. this guy's obsessed with fire oh, ants. Big oh, this, what, do the, what do the fire ants ever do to him? And they're amazing took social them creatures. Took 50 years to create that city. And yeah, this right. Dickwad he probably got one in his pee hole and yeah. said, enough already with yeah. these fucking things. Oh, really? They behave a lot better than certain members of our society. That's true. They fucking help each other. They don't cause a problem. Yeah. Water park. You don't see them going to other anthills and take shit and run out? Okay. I want to see these bullet ants. Dude, these are motherfuckers, these bullet ants. Oh, man. You put them in the uh, fucking an ant gun and you start shooting them. <laughs> Everybody's got bullets. <laughs> Why is the white guy doing this? Oh, wait, wait. I guess It's not a white guy tribe, is it? Oh, she's looking no, kind of good So today. what happens after they have look at those, gloves? Look at the gloves. They put these gloves on. So it's just a, a pain it's thing? It's a pain it thing. Look at this. Bigger or something. Oh. Look at those ants on both sides of the gloves. Yeah, I couldn't do that. Dude, look at that. Fuck that. There's a cluster of and they are biting the shit out of you. Oh, this guy go to the wrong resort. Yeah. <laughs> what the fuck did I get into? It's a white guy trying this. Why don't yeah. these people invent things? Yeah. They do. Doing they do ant gloves. Pain. I use all sense of time and place. But eventually my test of endurance seems to be over. Takes or is it only just beginning? Oh. Right. 
My hands feel like they've been stabbed by hundreds of Why, burning it, hot needles. Oh my God. It's yeah. black. But His removing black. them from the gloves brings little relief. As others take their turn, the pain begins to build she gave and me takes the over key, my whole yes. body. It's black, his hand. Yeah. These people are stupid. Yeah. Savages. She do it on his dick so it would get black and grow bigger. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> black's not from the ass, though. What? I don't think the black's from the ass. Yes, it is. Yeah? Of course it is. That's from being stung with the poison. That's purely from being stung. Wow. But he hails a taxi with the other hand. <laughs> <laughs> 15 <laughs> minutes later, Fuck. I'm in absolute agony. Oh, that's funny, yeah. dude. <laughs> he has a taxi with the other hand. Oh. Yeah, dude, the, 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 the fucking black goes up the arm, I think. Oh, God. Does it hurt? Yeah. Yes. Yeah, it feels like he was high-fiving or something. <laughs> God. <laughs> Shava said, do not make any force and just try to relax your muscles. Oh, try to relax your muscles. Oh, yeah, okay. yeah. That's what you want to say, the shaman. <laughs> relax me muscles. <laughs> <laughs> the shaman. Yeah, because he's the, crying. Uh, it's pussy. Right. The poison is going to go up your arm. Pussy. You can act like a man. What's the matter with you? Oh, they're all laughing at the white man weeping. Gonna, yeah, take me to a the fucking has to examine yeah. savage the hospital. It's worst. Yeah. Yeah. Well, that's what you get, stupid, for putting His on a glove of ants. Yeah. show how my body's reacted to this overwhelming dose of ant venom. You yeah. horse's patoot. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, makes you cry like a bitch. It's oh. probably, it's estrogen they fucking sing you with. Hormones. I'd, I'd rather see sex in the city, too. <laughs> oh. Calm down, Ralph. Have a marshmallow. <laughs> Don't play tricks on me. <laughs> he has to get a good blood sample in order to measure the changes in my blood chemistry. What kind of blood sample is this guy getting? I did this. Pulling out with a piece of bamboo. The toxin has stimulated the worst pain the human body is capable of experiencing. Jesus. Mm -hmm. Consciousness slips away. God damn, look at his nice. fucking fingers. What an ass. This is just to get on TV, right? That's well, the only reason he's going yes. this. Not like, they're not going to welcome him in the tribe. Look no. at him. Look at me. He looks like they're oppressed. He's bleary eyes. Open your eyes. No. See, I would do that for like a second. Hey, see. No. 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 Yes. Yes. Yeah, hello. Yeah. I can't come in today. My hands hurt. Stay in your own backyard. <laughs> yeah. Exactly. What are you doing Don't find there. those things. Let's go yeah. dancing. Let's go dancing, Chief. Bullet go. ants. Let's go dancing. I need a follow-up. What happens? Does his arm fucking fall off? No. Uh, it's dude, worse. I, I've what seen happens? it where the black goes all the way up the arm. I've Jesus. seen something when the natives do it. They have two on, and I guess they keep them on longer. Right. But they have to do that 20 fucking times over the course of a couple of years. That's uh, stupid. That's yeah. just dumb. It's kind of like contract negotiations here. Oh, shit! <laughs> Swim walk. <laughs> Want to make fucking mine something or, or fucking yeah. build uh, or a Or make ant, ant hats and pants pump. to go with it so you can have an entire <laughs> evening of ant wear. <laughs> Put a, make an ant brassiere for the ladies. And, and Maybe there's an end purpose, like it makes their an hands end purpose. better oh, for <laughs> digging or something. Never heard of such a thing. No. End person. Yeah. <laughs> end person. Oh, jeez. Why don't, starvation. Why don't they uh, make an ant tie or something? You put yeah. it on. <laughs> an ant tie. Yeah. That'd be nice. Yeah. <laughs> no, this is, uh, I, I, w w w why are people still doing this? It's 2011. I don't know. I would just be banging my fucking gloves and squashing the ants. Would you allow someone to step on your hand afterwards? <laughs> Ow. I don't know if it would oh add to God. it or, 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 or I don't know if it could make it worse. You imagine like a fucking a, a bunch of angry ants sting, oh, sting, no. sting, 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 <laughs> sting, sting. They sting, don't sting. sting and then go, all right, we got him. No. Get one mosquito bite, it ruins your night. Yeah. Fuck the f bullet ants. Yeah. Bullet ants are fucking <laughs> right in their ant assholes. <laughs> <laughs> fucking assholes. He's not afraid. <laughs> Dude, bullet ants are fucking They don't play. Brutal. Yeah. They're the, I think they're the most brutal insect bite. It's worse than wasps and hornets. Really? I, yeah, oh boy, I think so. I like getting stung by anything. I think that a bullet ant... What is that, Dan? 
The more you, he's just looking at you. The more years I go without getting stung, the, the more fear I have of getting stung. Of what? By, uh, anything. by anything. Yeah. What like, don't, don't you want to like be stung by? This. Bees. Any yeah. type of bees. Bees is number one on my list. Bees. Now, there's, there's a certain spider bite that their saliva is so toxic that oh, it just crazy. eats your flesh. Starts rotting your flesh bone. away. Yeah, yeah. yeah. None of us are going to the rainforest anytime yeah. soon. Yeah. yeah, exactly. There's a reason I'm not talking about. Go. I'm talking about shit in your own backyard. Oh. Yeah. number one fear? Wasps? Bees? I don't like bees. Our immune system. The system is used to any insect creature here, you know. There's yeah. some fucking thing that's going to kill you. I'd say a wasp out. is scariest because a hornet's yeah, bad, but a wasp has that fucking dangling legs. When, when their legs are just long, yeah. <laughs> their legs dangle. Yeah, they they're hurt. Giant. A, a wasp bite hurts. Uh, bumblebees don't sting at all. Oh, they're they don't. just annoying. They just... Yeah, but they're huge, they're big, just fat things. Fat things. Like, like fat bees. shit. Flying, yeah. <laughs> just getting in the way. Yeah. These fucking bullet ants. How do they fuck? If I was an yeah. ant, my dick would never stay hard for another <laughs> ant. I don't think they have to. How do they fuck? I, I would hate to have to get some ant pussy. Yeah. <laughs> ant pussy. Dude, we're just looking at an ant on a rock crawling around, and they just look like... They look like something out of the Terminator, like those machines that yeah, were Yeah, they fun. do. Yeah. very machine-like. Is that a yeah. dinosaur? No, he's an insect. They find oh, Helen Hunt very sexy. <laughs> <laughs> Ants have been around for quite a while, though. Since yeah. the dinosaurs? I don't know, maybe. I don't know, insect? Yeah, yeah, I think so. Probably. That motherfucker. Yeah, they've been around for a while. Will, he will they bite you. big, though. That looks, looks like a, a normal ant. Yeah. Everything was bigger, though. It's like, yeah, they've been around since, you know, the uh, prehistoric times. It's like, sharks have been around since prehistoric times. But, you know, they were fucking the size of a building. Yeah, they were. Giant things. They were back and then. And ants. Giant, oh, yeah, yeah, ants were fucking, and, and saber-toothed tigers and shit like that. Yeah. Everything was just giant back then. Yeah. Woolly mammoth. All scary. I don't know why they can't make an, a mammoth now. Like, <laughs> just take some DNA from that fucking... Bones or some of that mammoth flesh that they find frozen, <laughs> yeah. and then shoot it into a goddamn elephant. You don't need egg. to. <laughs> Just give an elephant a fucking raccoon lodge hat. Here you go, <laughs> fatso. <laughs> now go embarrass yourself. <laughs> Let it work our board. <laughs> you <laughs> mammoth. <laughs> you, you fucking mammoth. You know how humiliated an elephant would be if you just taped hair to it? <laughs> Big Greek elephant <laughs> running around. <laughs> That's Stavros, the elephant. Stavros. <laughs> I don't know why they can't do that, though. Get the DNA yeah. from the mammoth and then uh, p put it into the, the nucleus of a, an egg from an elephant. They can. Jurassic they can. Park was, was actually no, this, possible. That's why you're yeah, saying like, that. It's getting why closer. They're going to give it a shot. But I why would they? We wouldn't want dinosaurs now. I would I love them. Be cool they to would see do a mammoth. exactly what they did in the movie. <laughs> yeah, they really? Run amok. A velociraptor. Run amok in water parks and fucking parades and Memorial Day events. Yeah, kill Jeff Goldblum immediately. We got a guy that got bit by one of these bullet ants. Uh, uh, Nick in Jersey. Nick. Hi, Nick. You're on the phone. Ow! Ow! <laughs> Nick. Hello. Hey. Rich cunt. Oh, uh, he's gone. Sorry. His friend uh, Tommy. Maybe his, Maybe the bullet ant yeah. broke his phone. Tommy! Was it a hollow point? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't want to deal with those. What are you promoting, Otto, by the way? Oh. Yeah. I'm doing an... I'm working on an internet... Variety show called the Otto and George Pig Roast. We got a studio in Hoboken. We got a, a Hoboken? house band. Yeah, got a house band called Abruez and the Squatters. I'm gonna have guests on. I'd love to have you guys on. I, I don't have. Wow, a, damn. Um, right now we're rehearsing. We're doing uh, just. I'm, I'm, I'm practicing the uh, art of interviewing, which you guys have obviously. Twenty oh, failed that miserably. <laughs> no, I mean, it's not easy. What you're doing. I'm learning well. that. I'm learning just how to walk out. On stage to a band playing, you know, what do you do, you know? Think with Fredo entering a room. <laughs> you know, in the oh, Godfather. Yeah. Who the Fredo dance? Yeah. yeah. Okay. All right, get out of here. Get the hell out of here. Scram. No matter what, I look schmucky and awkward and unprofessional. Oh, what are you wearing when you do it? I haven't decided yet. It's pretty fucking hot in that studio right now. They haven't cranked the air up yet. But uh, that's what I'm working on. It's going to be called. Cool. I'm going to get uh, Pan and Teller on, uh, Lewis Black. Jimmy said he would do it. Very right. cool. That's um, cool, man. Copperfield eventually. Well, now, what, it, it's in Hoboken. You're going to do interviews, and what are you going to, you're not going to have an audience, you're going to have an audience? We're going to do f mock cutaways to an actual audience because uh, right now the, the place is too, it's not big enough to uh, have an audience, and it's going to be more of a. Uh, now, we're not ripping off the Larry Sanders show, but there's going to be a lot of sub <clears throat> subtext to the show. 
Uh, for instance, George, every week I'm auditioning a new uh, guy to be like the uh, Ed McMahon, but it, but in reality, George is trying to replace me on the show with another guy. So there's like that subtext. Um, <laughs> once puppet. it's shot, yeah, once it's shot, and I can show you an episode, I think I think you'll be impressed. How many episodes are you doing? Uh, I don't know. I mean, we're going to start, I guess, with six or five or six, something like that, before I invite a, a guest of, it, of importance on. You know what I mean? <laughs> I want to get the kinks out. Yeah. Um, but I, I think people are going to the Internet for entertainment now, and they're not watching yeah. TV. You know? The fuck? It yeah. is true. There's, there's nothing worth fucking watching on. Yeah. It's very rare you get something. It's got to be on a cable outlet or something because regular TV just sucks up fucking dick. The Paul Reiser yeah. show is good, though. This, this guy, <laughs> Jeff, uh, the guy that's producing this, his name is Bobby Capelli. He made six independent films. I did one of them. It's called Rules for Men. I was in it with um, Florentine and uh, Martling was in it and fucking Kamal from the Jerky Boys hey, Kamal. and Frank Gorshin it was a really it was a very low budget comedy is but he alive gets still Frank Gorshin or did he die Frank Gorshin's dead yeah, right? I hope he's, he's dead him. they buried him <laughs> but, um, <laughs> but anyway yeah, this Frank guy, Gorshin was great in 12 Monkeys oh did Frank that Gorshin one? he was where he's like really good yeah. He's, looking, he's looking at trying to figure out where fucking uh, the the guy went. He was a very intense fucking uh, Bruce uh, Willis comedian. Yeah, but, yeah. Yeah, it was like he, he did really good impressions. Yeah, he's dead. And he was like, he, he had the kind of a, he wasn't like um, just a, your regular impressions that would turn around and fucking, hi, oh, and it, well, it, might, it yeah. might look something like this. Right. He was like intense. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. Scary. Was, like, he scared me pieces. as a child yeah, watching he was, him. he was a little frightening. Yeah, sure. yeah. Sure, he used to curl up and go, help, the Riddler's going to bite my fanny. <laughs> it, was, it was very frightening, yes. Sure, I'd have to protect yeah. your fanny. <laughs> i put my hand so, on your bottom uh, the whole and point, I'd cup the, it. The whole point of this fucking thing is to get people to go to the website. That's the, that's the whole yeah. main thing with this shit. You gotta let people have to find out about it. So I'm gonna be attacking that guy, Tosh. That Tosh it, guy on yeah, Comedy Central. Tosh. Yeah. So by attacking him, if he acknowledges that my show exists, then I'll get a little press that, from that. That usually works. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Do you not yeah. like him? You don't like him? No, I, I don't care one way or the other. I just wanted to acknowledge that my show is on. You know, yeah, when it's funny. on. Yeah, that's what you, Yeah, that's the best way to go yeah. about it. So we're gonna start. <clears> just as <throat> it gets hot as fuck out, we're gonna start filming. This guy's gonna torture me in the studio. But it is a uh, fucking air conditioning. Sounds exciting. The oh, internet is like. Yeah, I'm working very hard. I've been to this place like, like three days a week, just going down there and just practicing with the band, getting a rapport going with the band. It's a, it's a shot, you know. Are you coming out with George every time? Are you holding George? Yeah, or? yeah. Unfortunately, I'm still a uh, ventriloquist. Fine. Yeah. So, so you're. Uh, all right. It's going to be my slant on a talk show. You know, I'll, I'll do an interview, mm -hmm. and then George will either say it's boring or they're full of shit, or he wants to fuck them. You know, what, what, uh, who have you interviewed so far? Just like Trish and like people you know? Or? Uh, well, today, today I got my buddy Wist, Mr. Will, who's backstage. He's an uh, underground genius comic. Uh, and my friend Johnny L. So was Frank Gorshin. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Underground. Plate, plate dead. Yeah, so we're doing two mock interviews today and filming it just to see if I could pull it off. You know, I'm, I'm an unqualified talk show host, but this guy believes I can do it. So, But that's fucking, that's one of the best things. Look, I don't want to inject myself into this, yeah. but I'm going to. Yeah. Okay. Uh, the, first of all, the internet thing is is a great idea. Yeah. I think we're right at the beginning of this whole fucking yeah, movement the to, birth of to it. get the fuck off of regular like what they've been shoving down our throats. Yeah. And, and with no options whatsoever. Right. And mm -hmm. now there's so many options, and it's good to be able to be one of those options. Sure. And uh, <clears throat> I do I do like that compound show from my basement. Yeah. And I want it to look as professional as possible. Right. Like, it looks like a set, and, and the, I spent money on lighting and yeah. green screening and everything, but B, as unprofessional as possible I in the execution of it. Okay. Because I'm fucking sitting there so in it looks a like professional you broke into set, a studio but at I'm night. drinking, I'm oh. drunk half the time I'm doing it. I watch the next day, I gotta cut the right. half out because I can't even watch it because oh, okay. I'm slurring, I'm a fucking <laughs> mess. And, and, but that's the shit that's like... That's fantastic. Do you have uh, guests on to talk to? Or you yeah, just, sometimes just, just friends hanging out. Right. Or my chick will sit down and fucking babble about something and I'll call her an so idiot. How do, I, how do I see this show? Plug. Like a, it's, a, oh, plug. Plug. It's, a, it's on Ustream. 
U stream. Uh, yeah, U stream. Okay. You just search live from the compound. Okay. And uh, I'm on that. And actually, uh, what I'm going to be doing. Uh, but Trish is probably listening. This she'll, week. she'll remember that. I won't. Yeah, live from the compound. Okay, just live from in, the compound. U stream. Uh, Do I put down Anthony com. Comia or anything? No, you just put live from the compound okay, and it. it'll pop up. Okay. And uh, see this. This week I'm going to do, <laughs> the, though, because now I have virtu I have virtual like televisions behind me. Mm -hmm. So I could sit there and at, at a desk. It looks like a fucking desk. A complete virtual set. Wow. And on the screen behind me, I put the. Uh, like the Casey Anthony trial. And I'm going to be doing <laughs> coverage. I'm okay. going to be doing some coverage of that. Okay. Uh, so, cool. yeah, my own, my own take on it. Is this, is this hot a, she is, is your objective with this is just for fun or are you just looking for fun for like, uh, money? Just for fun right now. It's like, you I know, want some of that fucking Bill Gates cash. Dude, he, he has, has some, a fucna uh, green screen that money. He has a green screen. It. That's great. And I, I fucking anything. I did a show once oh, and I was I, he was doing the intro. Yeah. And it was like it was just you couldn't see me at all. He had a green he had a green blanket over him and then just poked his ass through. So it's Jimmy's floating ass. Really? Just out of nowhere. It looked like a ghostly ass floating in the air. As if it? heaven had fallen to the earth <laughs> in the form of floating asses. <laughs> oh, that's, yeah, that's uh, that's what it looks like. There you go. That's part of the, uh, oh. and that isn't even, I'm, well, H I'm, I'm HD now. Outside. Jim, Jim, Jim has a very cute, so round, smart. hairless ass. Yay. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> like that's that the whole set is virtual. There's nothing behind us but a uh, green screen. Or substance. There's no so, substance. Or, yeah, no <laughs> substance either. That's awesome. No yeah. substance either. It's uh, in it's, lieu of talent. But it makes it, it makes it great because it's wow. just like it, it it looks so unprofessional. Wow. And I I, I or noticed that transvestite commercial earlier on the Super Bowl. Yeah, where where people wow. uh, are they going to be offended? I saw oh, that and I thought Bob someone's going to get pissed at that. Some anti. Oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> Holy shit! Wow. <laughs> wow. Oh my god, that is really bad. <laughs> Bobby oh farted. I can I tell. Wow, that was brutal. That's a real. That's yeah. a fucking. You know what that is? That's a meat fart. Oh, <laughs> oh god, yeah. Well, listen, he does that when he's nervous. Room. Got like phone lines. Yeah. Room. An 800 number. He's now on the other side of a glass looking in. I'm it's sorry. like a fucking. Was it bad? It's like a biohazard thing. She should have those. those those sleeves that you put your arms through to do things la, in. La, 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 la. <laughs> Not that sleeves. I was trying to do that the whole show. I <laughs> almost shit my pants twice. Trying to that would have been worth it. You got to take the risk. Man. <laughs> you got to take the risk. How come, like, this guy's all about risk. How come, like, Break. for instance, this radio show isn't also, like... Oh, uh, oh Jesus. Jesus. What are you, what are you crazy? You that? Why don't you go down the hall and get yourself an office? Oh, is that, is that a bad idea? Just, no, it's just it's one oh. of those things that uh, people in They're this They're just business, begging us to leave is what it is your answer? <laughs> yeah. I don't know. They're begging us to leave because they, they're forcing us to cultivate other means. They don't. They don't see. They don't see what this could be in the, the, future. In the future. This, I think of course, this should have a visual element. We've been saying for visual years. Element. And everyone else uh, that doing podcasts have the visual element. They're the, begging us to just fucking leave after the, this. Concept. The online it's it's feed yeah. is yeah. constantly you guys broken. Are gigantic. Yeah. I don't understand. Why would we stay here if we could do other better stuff somewhere else? The online oh, so feed you're, is you're always... looking forward to the contract being up? Yes! So you... oh, I didn't know if that. If you need oh. to know? Yeah, I didn't know that. I, I, I knew you were mad <laughs> about the deal that they struck, but I... Oh, whatever. Yeah. I mean, you know, we had to move on from that, and yeah. of course we were mad. They treated us like shit, but <laughs> we're still just doing radio when there's so much other stuff going on out there, and we we went to them with the ideas. So I'm dumb, dumb as a bag of hammers. I mean, I knew you guys weren't, you know, happy with the last contract, but well, fuck. You, you know, got guys... Is, as long as you're in some form, you know, because... You guys... You got guys. A lot of people can't live without you. You know. You it's got guys below us that that are doing way more because they yeah. they got the audio and they got the visual. A visual like aspect. And to we the used show to have the visual, great. and they took it away from us. We had how many cameras? Pal eight. Talk cameras all over the place. I think we had oh, eight. Just kind of fun digital to, cameras yeah. every morning. So Remote people could control. Check that out. We were able to move them around. But uh, they for just some said, reason, they just you took all that away. Throw them one of those Sonny Corleone beatings where you sma <laughs> smash him in the face with garbage the garbage pail lid. Hit him with the shoe, uh, bite so his hand. Great. Yeah, anything. <laughs> you know, bite his yeah. knuckle. I love it. Yeah, he's biting his hand. He's so angry. He's, half the shots are missing. The guy is so <laughs> pissed off. It's greatest beating ever. That is a fantastic uh, beating. beating. There's your answer. You don't yeah. even really know this business that well, and you yeah. see it. Yeah. Everyone sees it, but for some reason. But why is, wait, why is the know. online player does not work? I get so many tweets. It's oh, happening yeah, today. Yeah, yeah. But I mean, I dude, I get them every day. People yeah, will say the online play. These are adorable. That plus a fucking visual <laughs> element would be very good. Oh, it's my Diet Coke. I have a smaller bottle like of Diet adorable. Coke. A lot yeah. of people tweeting that they can't listen online again yeah. today. We went oh, to that. I, I don't know. We got that problem in the car. Trish loves listening to the show on the way back from work. She's pissed off. 
Uh, this is the only reason I have fucking serious fuck. radio. The only reason is is because because of Opie and Anthony. Where the fuck is it? And now the, the guy goes, oh, well, you got to bring, this is a month later. You got to bring the car to the shop. She goes, why did you tell me that a month ago? What? So, and so why? The, By the way, the fucking yeah. web guy, the serious website, there's always mistakes, I think. Ugh. Yeah, um, yeah. It's, it's time. Yeah. There are, right? Yeah. It's yeah. all really, yeah. really stinks. I, is it yeah. true that uh, the replay still has the old channel uh, numbers, too, I think? Really? I don't know if it's true. Uh, at one point, she was saw. talking to some guy who was in, like, Pakistan about uh, just about Bin Laden. Laden. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> in all fairness, I might be speaking out of turn because yeah. I, I, I don't want to get these guys in trouble, but... I apologize. I should no, because it it's, it's everything that airs on this show airs in the replay. So. Then maybe it's coming from somewhere. Maybe it's the online feed they didn't wow. change. Could be. I don't know what runs on the online. I bet you it's the online feed that they didn't change up. I think that fucking web, there's so many mistakes on the website. Like, from what I've, like, people keep saying, that this is wrong, that's wrong. Who cares? The Boneyard man. Facebook it's, page is no good. fine. <laughs> Everything's good. Everything's fine. Don't worry about it. Eh, that's not true. Everything's fine and dandy. I love the picture in the office of uh, Richard Dreyfuss. It's, How great is that? You're standing next to him, and you're like some hooligan who's trying to sneak into the frame. Oh, the photo yeah, 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 we, we photobomb yeah. each We've other. We've been oh, yeah. fucking everybody's <laughs> photos We've up in the We've been photobombing for a couple of years yeah. now. Obviously taking a bad shot. Oh. Yeah, we've actually had some good shots that people get like someone in the background. Yeah, we got yeah. we got to Photoshop them out. Oh, okay. Yeah, we photo ends up being a good everybody. picture. <laughs> we we just fucking suck. <laughs> <laughs> Dreyfus was awesome. Yeah, but he came cool. in for that dumb. Uh, uh, was it Poseidon? Uh, Poseidon, Poseidon adventure? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, Poseidon. Oh, he knew it sucked too. Really? He did. Yeah. Did he say it outright? Or no, no, he couldn't. We almost got him in for the Jaws ripoff. He did. Uh, no, I think he was sick because he was going to come back. He yeah. was in Piranha. Oh, yeah. fuck. And he was actually Matt Hooper. Really? In Piranha. Yeah. What is yeah. he He's doing? No, but that was supposed to be Ruining a goof. the character. Going into what, that movie was a good one. What about, what about yeah, Bob? Know. He was great. He was supposed to be campy. Yeah. Mm -hmm. huh? He was full of turkey. Bob. What about Bob? I loved What About Bob. Hysterical. He's fat. Oh, sorry. <laughs> when, <All right>. <laughs> <laughs> My favorite line, Bill Murray's eating the corn. He goes, is this corn hand shucked? <laughs> <laughs> a question out of nowhere. What about Bob? Is a fucking fine film. Oh, yeah, it's hysterical, right? It's great. Yeah. <laughs> it's going fucking Tony Tony Soprano's fat sister is in it. The hooker who Oh, calls. I hate her. Yeah, and oh, fuck it. Okay. he has to spray the phone with Banaka mm. before he takes oh. the receiver. He's Why? Germaphobe. It's oh. funny. Yeah, I gotta I'm interrupt because we started this we didn't even do this on the air, but this Chinese premieres got game. He's playing hoops on a six foot hoop. Oh yeah, the the hoop. It's, <laughs> yeah, the Chinese premiere. Yet? He's he's with a bunch of uh, kids and he's showing off his uh, mad <laughs> skills at basketball. Oh, yeah. And the hoop has got to be at, at maybe the highest six. six feet. Maybe Good. six feet. And he's doing layups. <laughs> right. He can't even fucking. Wow. He can't even dunk. It's only six feet. Stubborn fidget. Twenty-five, uh, seventy-five cases of horse herpes now. <laughs> but I like the story because they show this chick with the braces. <laughs> yeah, a mounted posse junior Anthony. queen contest had to pony up with sticks. Well, it's kind Ugh. of weird, but you know you can't really help that the disease is going around. Seventy-five yeah. or more cases of horse herpes. Who's this fucking in nine lisping woman? Oh, so nope. Horses don't give people herpes. Yeah. Tear other horses, and it's often fatal. But a stick horse sticks around. She was the one that got us fucked for the voyeur book. A stick horse yeah. sticks around. She's, she's the one that got us fucked yeah. around. I'm Actually, John Long Montana. Actually, before horse herpes at ranch rodeos like the Western this Heritage Classic in Texas. I, I didn't know this was going on. This is like the beauty pageants, huh? Yeah, this looks like some kind of Western beauty Instead pageant. Instead of shaking uh -huh, the stick, they him pretend the stick <laughs> They oh, spit God. in a circle after he throws his hat up in the air. <laughs> he always gets chafed on his thighs. <laughs> you gotta rub... You gotta put... Put Earl on him in some lotion. Oh, Uncle Paul. Yeah. He likes when you put the little bit of lotion on the thighs. Because they was chafing from his little hobby horse stick. I haven't, I haven't met Uncle Paul yet. Yes, you have. It's a new one? No, when you was a boy, I used to come over. Oh. I used to massage your back. Oh, jeez. Hey, is it illegal to hire a hooker if you're not going to have sex with her? Why? No, it's not because they say I want, my. I want to do that like for the, the compound thing. I want oh. to hire a hooker, no, it's not have her come in, and then just have a horrific interview with her about like how she 
got into doing that. Yeah. And, and then maybe she just takes her top off. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and maybe she just sits there with her top off. Just or don't something, pay but... her on camera. Then no, you can pay her. That, yeah. That you, uh, but I would pay. It would, it would just be like a guest fee for the show. Yeah. I'd yeah. be like, here, I'm paying you to appear on my program. I would speak to an attorney before. Yeah. They. Legal advice from a ventriloquist. <laughs> <laughs> that is true. Yeah, yeah. Well, you know, uh, Otto did say. Yeah. Didn't we? We should just do that on our show. Yeah, well, they wouldn't fucking let us. That's what it is. True. You know, we can't be hiring. Uh, the lawyers say that, uh, even though it's completely legal, the lawyers have said is that we don't want your show to be date? good. Those guys yeah. talk like Anthony Weiner down the hall, don't they? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Kind of right on the fence, don't answer anything. Yeah. What do you think of the Weiner thing? Are you following Wienergate? Wienergate? No. Yeah, it's uh, a not. politician that fucking it's, nah, it's tweeted fine. his it's fucking word for boner zipper. in his underwear. He did? Okay. Yeah. <laughs> for some chick. <laughs> okay, sure. I guess he and didn't want to win. It. He said he got hacked. You do want to win or you don't want to win? <laughs> fucking weird. I was he, he, said, he said his Twitter got hacked and it wasn't him. But now it's starting to look like he was following some <laughs> people that he probably shouldn't have been. Anyone insane. that has Twitter knows it's bullshit. Really? Oh, yeah. Yeah, fuck that. Yeah. Be I may have been wrong, by the way. Twitter just corrected me. Wow. Some guy goes, stop talking about bullet ants. The black is from ash to protect them, sort of. Doesn't work. So I may have been incorrect. Oh, no. uh, sorry. I heard that the black thing is uh, to make them bite. Yeah. Uh, whatever it is, I was wrong saying it was from the poison. Yeah. It could be ash to make them bite. They're saying it, that helps make them bite. I, I don't think they... It seems like they don't anyway. need to fucking... Dumbass they need custom. Help to bite. Exactly. exactly. They're, they're encased in a glove. They're already cranked. You know how annoyed yeah. an ant is? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> they hate being in gloves. They never, the mittens, they're very passive in mittens. Yeah. They, they like mittens. They do because they're in a half circle, and that calms the ant. Yeah. There's a half circle. There's something about it. Do you believe they're pixelating the underwear shot? Oh, of, I thought that uh, was his pubes yeah. popping no, off. No, they were pixelating. Pushing forward. Yeah. Lewd pick of man in underwear so sent from team build. Wiener's talking about for a couple of days. I'm not going to allow it to decide what I talk about for oh, the next, next, week, 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 the next yeah. two weeks. Wow. The objective of the person who is doing the mischief is to try to distract me from what and I'm doing. I made a decision. I'm not going to let it happen today. Wiener's refusal to looks like a pile of fire ants. <laughs> He refuses to answer any more questions. But he did deny it. I want you to tell me what's my best profile. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the honeymoon. Is, he, didn't, he didn't make that up. Oh, no. Of course I didn't. <laughs> <but> thank you. <laughs> oh, he's got a horrible nose, huh? That is some schnoz. That's that's schnoz a are just, they're they're the ding, worst, ding, aren't they? Yeah. 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 They can't answer one fucking yeah. question. Do you like that scene? No. I hate it. Mm. I think gadink 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 Everybody wants to get into the act. <laughs> Douche chill. Um, think he's being endearing. That Michael J. Fox oh. scene that's really oh. uncomfortable. Oh. I wouldn't mind seeing that. Where, he, wow. where he's doing the fucking... Uh, Kirk Douglas and Michael J. Fox, when yeah. Michael J. Fox is playing nephew, oh. trying Jimmy to Durante, uh, entertain impression. his uncle. Oh, yeah, by bad? doing it, it's, His uncle's in a wheelchair or some shit. It's humiliating. It's trying to be touching, but it's, it's so just sucky. Do you yeah. get embarrassed when you see that? Yes, I don't even... I, oh, wow. You don't like so. a rink-a-dink-a-doo? <laughs> no, a di I don't. <laughs> it's horrible. Uh oh. He's in a wheelchair and <laughs> he's trying to make him feel better. Is that what the whole thing is? Yeah, instead mm -hmm. of fixing his legs. <laughs> 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 Those pristine sneakers. Ugh. Uh, fucking Alex Rodriguez never smiles. Fucking guy. Should. Cheater is such a likable guy. Uh -huh. and he's like, like a villain. <laughs> fucking a Rodriguez. Villain. Oh. Isn't he? Oh, is this a smile yeah, once? Here it is. Okay. Here I am. That's the best that's been. Oh, okay. Oh. Oh. Yeah, it's a horrible copy. It feels so much better. So oh. far, this though. is Jimmy yeah. Durante. I can't watch this. <laughs> no. I can't watch this. This is so bad. Yeah. Oh, God. He's going up the steps. Yeah. Oh. You should only get cancer. I hope you get cancer. <laughs> a shake a do, a shake a do. Yeah. I, I drop the lemonade on the floor again. <laughs> I knock everything off the table. A ra cha cha. That's the sound China makes when it's hitting the floor. A ra cha cha cha. <laughs> oh. yes. 
What a fucking awful movie this is. <laughs> this is awful. What made you think of this? This is terrible. I hate God. Cha -cha 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 -cha. Fucking stroke victims stay out of films and <laughs> stop depressing everybody. <laughs> <laughs> fucking crawl into a fucking coffin and die already. <laughs> Making movies. Yeah. <laughs> depressing uh, everyone. Yeah, we got a ah, cha -cha -cha. eating. <laughs> Oh, that's right. Look at the time. Holy Meeting time. Holy fuck on a stick. Well, Language. Otto, this no. was a great hour and a half, sir. Now, yes. Thanks for having me on. Killed it. Otto. Otto and George dot com. Otto and George on Twitter. Yeah, look for this pig roast. I don't have any website for it yet. I'm going to be at Bananas July 9th in Hasbrook Heights, too. Ooh. Fucking. The very, great very Otto and George. George. Right. But things are happy. Oh, I'm doing something with that Coke Logic guy, too. Okay. Oh, yeah. Yeah, he's going to yeah, be good. Yeah, Hopefully he's great, it involves right? a gym. He's great, right? <laughs> he's a big boy. Is he a big fat boy? Hopefully it involves a gym. <laughs> exactly. I, he's a big I gotta boy. I got to feed him and clothe him. <laughs> <laughs> is, he, is he a real, really, a real He's oinker? very talented. He is sure is. He really he is. is. He's, he's Do you have any aerial good. photographs of him? <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> he's a <an> oinker. <laughs> <laughs> uh, let's get the fuck out of here. I got a goddamn uh, meeting or some shit. You're listening to Opie and Anthony. On the virus. Sirius XM.